What's up guys? Just want to report some good news. So, uh, left this going to charge up all day. The uh, bank's sitting between 12.6 and 12.7 now, which is its cutoff, which is great. Got over 15 coming in. To the controller still. It's only pushing in a couple of watts. 39.6 was the watt hour peak, almost 11 amp hour for the day, which is 140 watt hour. No, it's going to keep rotating the video, sorry. Uh, new addition, just an old circuit breaker just to break the circuit uh, if I need to. But now the sun's setting. Um, the voltage is dropping out down. We're down at about 11 now. The sun's well over the western side, so uh, we uh, got 39.6 watts peak. Almost 11 amp hours into this today. 140 watt hours. Minimum voltage. Watts peak. Yeah, that's what it's going to show us. So we're not actually transferring anything at the moment because the voltage is too low on the solar side, but uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run this down pretty hard tonight and uh, see what we can collect tomorrow, it's meant to be a nice sunny day all day and uh, we might even get up on the roof and make a different kind of mount for the solar panel so it gets uh, more solar gain for more of the day but just thought I'd update the way the little charge controller is working and uh, just show you that I've stuck the uh, circuit breaker in there to give us a uh, mode of disconnecting solar panel from charge controller if we need to we can easily disconnect the battery that's just alligator clips because it's still nice low current so no real issues with that but uh, yeah that's it thanks for watching I can give you a link to one of these if you want one shoot me a message or uh, leave a comment down below and uh, yeah it's time I think it's time to build a big pack with some fuses and uh, get some solar panels and make myself a power wall and cash in on the, uh, the free sunshine over uh, summer. Catch you on the next one guys.